All right. Let's get after Thunder Loops in here. We're going to start the morning turn. It's May 2nd, 0700. And it looks like the Allies have their front defense line. Um, probably fall back into here. Unless Napoleon just can't do nothing with them. But I guess we're about to find out. So we start with the Prussia turn. Prussia and Russia. They don't have any reason to activate until they get hit. So let's get their morale up some more so they get to day turn. So they get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, they get ten. Alright. So we move the morale chip up. So now they have 91. Alright, Napoleon needs to start the attack. So I'm sure we'll go with May to start. So Napoleon is ah he's, he's supposed to, yeah he posts okay he would have posted at the end of the last turn I forgot to do that and he is going to commit nay which will be four points so he's going to burn four one two three four and let's let the battle begin here. Uh, let's see if we can't, uh, let's fire some artillery here. Since they weren't activated yet, yeah, it'll be the French turn, so. Alright, so this guy can fire three times at him. Is it on a hill? Nope. Alright, so he can shoot, artillery can shoot two, and they can shoot for every movement point they got. So if they were like to move one, then they could only shoot two. Um, if they're on a hill... Uh, like you see here, that's a hill. They can shoot three hexes. So we're going to fire. Let's see if we can't hurt that artillery. So it's going to be four into a three. So that's going to be a plus one. All right. So plus one. And we roll a three on the chart. And that is a defender retreat. So he means he, it's a small DR. So that means he gets reduced. All right. So he's reduced. And let's fire again. Now it's four to two, so it's plus two. And we roll a four. And it's a defender retreat, so he is now eliminated. All right, so they lost one morale for a unit reduced. And then they lose, reduced strength is minus five. So one, two, three, four, five on the morale. He's down to 85 morale points. All right, so the artillery, he's got one more, but he's got nothing else he can shoot at. He can move one. Yeah, let's move him one. <clears throat> Which means I'm going to have to get after these guys in here. So let's try to break this front here with one, two. And three to get in there, so it's four to two. Let's see, are there any mods? Um, nope, infantry mods, hex, hex, general, attacking, when stacked with friendly commander, armies demoralized, defending French, nope, okay, so, plus two, and he rolls a two, DR, all right, so the defender is reduced, all right, and he's still got one more point, so he can... Fight him again. This time it's plus three, and he rolls a six, which is a major DR. So he took a reduced. That's one, and then he took a loss. That's five. One, two, three, four, five. So he's down to 79 morale points. All right, and this guy has moved into here. All right, so now it's going to get a little tougher. Let's get... Uh, I want to get an A involved. I'm going to get him killed, but I need to get him where he can help his units. He's only got a movement of eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. This guy sitting in the town? No, he's not. All right, so no artillery over here. 
Uh, so let's go. Let's move me to him. Right. Now he's got a lot of ground he's got to cover to keep his units in command, so I'm not going to be able to do that. He's got a unit stretched all the way over to here. So one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He's going to have to move up a little bit. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We'll move him into the. We'll move him up to here for now. All right. And one, two, three, four, five, six. And he's still within because he get, remember Nay has a he has a command radius of eight where everybody else has six. All right, so let's get after, let's, yeah, I gotta take a shot, so let's get after this guy here. And let's go one, two, three, and then four. So that's gonna be minus one, all right? And that's a four at minus one. That's attack or retreat. Remember, full French infantry, they can retreat instead of taking a step loss. All right, let's try it again, one, two. That's why you need that leader in there. Minus one again. He's got to roll high to do anything. So now he rolls a three. So once again, we get an attack or retreat. All right, let's try the next guy. One, two. Once again. This time he rolls a six. At minus one, that's a defender retreat. So he is reduced. Now he's a four. And that guy moved one, two, three. So now he's going to go one more time. At even and he rolls a two at even and that's attack or retreat and you can displace units if you have to there was a point morale point for that all right all right so let's get after him with the next guy one two the even there he rolls a two so attack or retreat all right and then one two Three, four. All right. And he rolls a four at even. So that's a defender retreat. He is eliminated. So there's five more morale points. One, two, three, four, five. Well, that sword goes down fast. All right. And he moves into that, that hex. Now, after it can only, they can only attack one time. Cavalry can continue to attack. So I probably need to get some cavalry up here, and the guard is the best cavalry, but the points just to have them activated, it's what a pain, or it's expensive. All right, so what do we got here? We got a 2-7. Let's get after him. 1, 2, 3, into there. Let's attack him. So that'd be plus 1 infantry, attacking into a town. Yep, so they're okay. So it's plus one. And he rolls a two. Attack or retreat. Great. Now you can't retreat into an enemy zone of control no matter whether there's a friendly unit there or not. So one, two, three, four. No. One, two, three. We'll attack this guy who is a two. So that's plus two. And he rolls a two. Oh, defender retreat. Okay. So he is reduced. There is a point loss for them. All right. And that's it for him. So we can attack with this guy here. Let's go one. And that'll be plus two. And he rolls a three. And that is a defender retreat. And that is an elimination. So there's five more points. One, two, three, four, five. And this goes down there now down to 67 morale points. That's four cavalry units the Prussians have lost. And Blucher's boys, have, or the Russians, I'm sorry. And Blucher has lost, the Prussians have lost that one big infantry unit. All right, so he took that one, so he moves. All right. Here. Another cavalry unit. Hmm. So let's go. Go one. One, two, and we'll attack him. It's going to be, e oh, he's got a leader. Oh, wait, lead two leaders? Yeah, so it's minus one. And he rolls a two, and that is the attacker retreat. 
Yeah, I don't know if that was going to be such a good thing. Anyhow, where's this guy? He's sitting in the clear. Should have attacked him. So let's artillery him. What do we want to do this guy? Now let's artillery him. Shoot, we can hit him three times. Even. Two. Nothing. Now artillery, when they're shooting at range, any adverse effect doesn't affect them. All right. Then he rolls a five. At zero, that's a DR. All right. And he's still got one more shot. So... A morale point lost, and he's got one more shot. He rolls a four, and this is a plus one defender. Small, he's eliminated. All right, there's another unit one, two, three, four, five. All right, their morale is now down to 61. So, I don't know if I'm going to attack him or not. But we can go one, two, three. Yeah, let's take one shot at him. One, two, three. Let's take one shot at minus one. And he rolls a one attack or retreat. All right. All right. So nothing really lost right there. Um, do we want to get out on the outside over here? I mean, Napoleon doesn't have as much cavalry as you would thought. I'm going to end up having to activate the guard. I know that. I know that. Uh, he is sitting in a town. He is not. One, two, three, four. That's going to be, that'll be minus two in there. Because he's a five. Uh, let's see. What's he got? I think these guys are, no, he's not either. He's got a leader with him. Well, let's see if we can't push that cavalry back. So let's go one into there. That'll be even. He rolls a one. Attacker retreat. Imagine that. We'll do it this way. One, two, three into there. And again, attacker retreat. I don't have much luck with that. And if I did attack at a minus two, I mean, you got to... Yeah, you take a chance of him being disrupted. So let's let's uh, we'll move it. We'll take one shot. It's gonna be minus two. Oh God! And I rolled a one, and that's the big AR. So he gets reduced and retreated. All right. So he gets reduced and retreated. All right. So we won't do that one again. But we'll move him in here, or excuse me, we'll move him in here. All right, so they took a morale point hit. Stunning, they lost one. Napoleon's still sitting on a 103 uh, activation or morale points. Um, Kavrik, he's he's not going to be worth much. Let's get him out here. One, two, three, four, five, six. We'll get him out here, maybe get him on the edge. Should I activate the guard Cav? Yeah, I probably should. Yeah, let's activate the guard cab. So that's going to be four. All right, one, two, three, four. And that brings them down to 99 points. All right. And let's get the guard cab moving here. Now they can move extended using this stuff. So they can go one, two, three, four, five. And now he's hit that main road, so he can go ten. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, bring his buddy right behind him, and he's with him. All right. Uh, let's see. I don't, wanna, I don't really have any attacks over here. That's a four. He's a five. One, two, three, four. Let's get them up here. He can't attack. I don't think I'm going to attack him. With um, that, that'll be another minus two. We see what happens over here. All right, we're gonna. They're somewhat shattered over here, so I don't know whether I need to keep up that fight or not. Do I want to activate? You know, see, this would be typical here for Napoleon. Let's create a hole, and then let's push something through it. 
and try to cut off what we can. It's almost like the Germans during uh, doing their encirclement during World War II. So let, let's go ahead and we'll activate the Fifth Corps. I was actually the first ones to come on the board. Yeah, supposed to, I should do all that at the start of the turn, but still learning to play this one. So let's go to two. All right, let's get these guys moving here. So he's on the road, but they'll probably go to, so he'll be able to move five on there. One, two, three, four, five. Start getting them up. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Look at that creep there. You can't stack, remember. Um, oh, he's on the road. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. He can go one more if he stays on the road. So we'll go to seven right there. All right, we'll call that it for the zero 700 turn. We we'll go to zero 800 turn. All right, Prussians, they got to, oh, these guys got hit. They got to activate. All of these guys got hit. Hmm. So the minute they, they were committed, they're committed. So I don't think they're going to be able to stay there. I think they're going to have to fall out. So they would have had four more points on their morale. They would have had last on their activation. One, two, three, four. All right, so he's down to 50-something, and he's got to activate them again because they're, or I'm sorry, he's got to commit to them again because they're already active. Um, actually, he doesn't have to. He could leave. They were attacked. He could put them back into reserve. You don't want to get one point back, though. So now let's, let's keep them activated. So we're going to one, two, three, and four. One, two, three, four. All right. And he's probably going to have to activate Tormasov because this isn't going to hold over here. So let's activate Tormasov too. We'll do it right this time. All right, so Tormasov, that's two. One, two. All right, but now you got these guys are still in reserve, so there's four back. One, two, three, four. All right, so he's sitting on 50. All right, let's maneuver. Much as I'd like to hold that, that's just not going to work. Could hit a couple of these guys. He's only a three. What's he got? What's he got? He's at four with a lead. That's five. That's that's that would be a plus two. That's not going to do anything because he'll just retreat. Oh no, this is a yeah. No, if a French infantry suffers, a uh, little AR or little DR, they can retreat instead of being reduced so you'd have to you'd have to ah i see so let's move him into here which if he gets attacked in there he's gonna get his ass kicked so if you attack him in there put him in there and then attack with that four into three, five into three because of the leaders, a plus two. He, oops, he cannot retreat. And he rolls a one. Plus two and he rolls a one. And the attacker reduced, full strength attackers are reduced. Do you believe that? He suffered a reduce. So now he's cavalry, he can't do anything else. Amazing. And leaders can be killed by overrun if they're left alone in a hex. Um, or their unit gets eliminated. The attacking unit moving in there occupies it and they capture him. So if he would have won that attack there and caused him to be... He would have had to been reduced because he can't retreat. Zone of controls, like I say, they don't, they're not protected by other units. So, by friendly units. Alright, so... Man, that didn't work out at all. And he, if he gets attacked, he's in a town. Man, he's gonna. That was a, that was terrible because he's gonna he's gonna die. All right, let's see. Right. 
what do we want to do? Well, I can't pull them out now. I've done messed that up. So I guess let's get them back here near Blucher. Well, let's see. These guys are activated. That's not going to do any good unless you block them off. Yeah, trying to use this Prussian or Russian artillery against the French, that's going to be difficult. This guy's cut off. He's he's not. He can't. He, there's no supply rules in this game, so he might as well attack somebody. Maybe he'll get lucky. Let's see. He goes here. That would be one. One. That'd be a plus one. And he rolls a two. Guess what? He gets freaking reduced. Oh, I gotta mark that point morale point for those. So both of these, whoops. Both of these units have, god darn it. You can tell this is an old TSR game, by the way, the counter sprues. I think I clipped these with toenail clippers because my Oregon laminator, my last plastic one had broken. And I didn't have any, my new ones weren't here yet. And by the way, with those, I don't know what it is with me, but I keep shattering those handles now, granted, I've probably gone through, punched 50 full games. Some of them are rather large in like a month or two months. So, but I shattered two of them. And um, so I ordered the metal ones this time. And the metal one that works just great for me. And I got to drop that morale down too for those two reduced units. Well, it looks like he's going to be sacrificed. Um, do I want to shoot? See, that's just not going to do anything. Not an infantry. If you're shooting a cavalry or artillery, it'd be a different story. So let's, uh, man, Napoleon just wrecked that side over there. Well, I'll tell you what, before we move, I mean, yeah, he can't, that's, that's useless. That is useless. Oh, wait a minute, French. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I can't. Uh, the only thing that's going to happen is they're just going to blow through there. These guys have got to get out of here. So, so he can get on that road right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He can't do that because he'll be in that zone of control. So he's going to go one, two, three. All right. They need to sort of help him. So one, two, one, two, one, two, three. And we got over here. One, two, three. And what's he got? One, two, three. He could use the road. One, two, three, four. All right. So we'll do that. Um, these guys are still holding. They're pretty potent over here. I wonder if we can... One, two, three, four, five, six. If he could get around them, that would be... The, oh, wait a minute. One, two, three, four, five, six. There you go. What do we got? And let's go... No, he won't build a tag, so we'll go here. There's one so five. There's a plus one into him, and he won't be able to go nowhere. And we roll a four. He's been retreating since he can't retreat because of zones of control. Hey, we reduced a French unit. Woohoo! He doesn't have to retreat, though. He didn't lose his ground, but he reduced one. Uh, take them down another point. All right. And right now it's 96 to. 53. All right. Let's take a shot. What do we got here? Oh, three. One, two, three, four, five. And that's going to be minus one. So whew, that's dangerous. He got a little five or six. He rolls a five. He can't go nowhere. So we got a French 
After unit killed, that's five morale points. One, two, three, four, five. Believe me, I'm very Napoleon oriented. He's probably my favorite person in history, or one of them anyhow. But uh, you kind of like to see the underdog sometimes do good. All right, so do we want to do any attacking over here? So we get a bunch of plus ones. One. Right, let's do one, two. Let's attack him, plus one. And we roll a three at plus one, defender retreat. He can displace. Let's just push him back. And he goes in there. And then let's go up here with him. That'll be five, six with the leader. That'll be a plus two. Oh, wait a minute. What's he at? Clear. All right, plus two. He rolls a one at plus two. Oh my god. That's twice. So he gets reduced. Mm -mm -mm. Another point lost. Come on. Come on, dice. All right. This guy here, what's he want to do? He's a five. Now, I don't want to give up that hex right there, so we'll leave that be. All right. So that is it for the allies. All right, let's start the uh, 0800 turn for Napoleon. See how much time's on that video there. All right, uh, 26 minutes.